Hey there, guys. Frank Omatic here. Apologies for missing last week, but uh, the third semester, and that is the most hectic time of work by far. I was kind of struggling on what I wanted to record, and then I noticed that apparently, ass climber, apparently I had never uh, done a video on good old Ice Climber. Which I'm a little shocked by, honestly. So let's take a look at Ice Climber. This is one of the good old black, bo ah, black box releases. And, uh... Not one that a lot of people like. It's got a very weird jump physics to it. You go very high, but not very far. You can kill birds with your hammer, as as you do. You can also go through one uh, block wide holes, but it's a little tricky. I just did it there like it's nothing, but uh, that was completely a fluke. You, get out of here. There we go. Those guys in the Japanese version were seals, if I recall. But anyways, the goal is to climb up to the top. So you can collect whatever... <laughs> so you can collect whatever fruit was stolen from you. Or vegetable, I guess. I, I didn't do a great job there. But then you move on to the next mountain. Which is naturally a little more difficult. Get lost, bird. You get out of here, too. You can also, yeah, you can kind of, like, hook around like that a little bit. It's easier to get a bit of a running start to it. Yeah, this game isn't super popular. Mainly because it's very awkward to learn how to play. I kind of like it, though. Anyways, if you want to get the full bonus, uh, I may be too late at this point. You gotta get all the way to the top. Well, I'm definitely too late now, as I totally botched it. I can't believe I did the same thing twice and then fell off the bottom. Uh, you gotta get to the very top, and the pterodactyl that we saw on the first stage will be up there, and you can grab onto it for maximum bonus. We probably won't see that today, because I am doing a terrible job. This is where it starts getting a little tricky. There you go. And yeah, these jerks, when they run into a hole, will uh, fill it up. That's what they do. This is like a conveyor belt. Whoa, it's pushing me that way. All right. Well, that, that didn't work out. Are you kidding me? Uh, I'll be honest, I expected to die way before this point. Are you kidding me again? I can't believe this is where we're gonna lose. Can't believe I lost two lives there in basically the same spot. Alright, let's see if we can get to the top once. Nope, want to be on this side. There we go. Yep, then you do that, and you get your bonus. Don't know why I was making that so hard. I'm pretty sure most people know Ice Climbers better from uh, Smash Brothers than they do from their own game, which is a little sad. But at the same time, I get it. This is a very weird and awkward game. I just jumped to my death. Can't believe it. Get out of here. There we go. 
Yep, those conveyor belts push that way, okay. I guess... Alright, there we go. Jumping from moving platform to moving platform is very difficult in this. We made it, though. Alright. Uh, I gotta collect the pickles. The funny ha-has. Well, that was an impressive way to kill myself, if nothing else. I don't know that I've ever played this level before. This might be farther than I've ever gotten. Uh-oh, the B button's getting a little sticky on my controller. I'm gonna have to do something about that. I can't believe that just happened. Can't believe it's gonna happen again. Which I don't think it's sticking so much as it just feels like it is, as this controller has seen a lot of use. Still probably worth taking a closer look at when I'm done here. Oh my god, get out of here. I'm really having a hard time making it onto these platforms. I keep doing the same thing over and over again. <sighs> yep. And here comes this guy to ruin my life and game over me. Oh well. We could continue, but let's uh, go forward a level, just for fun. Let's see what level 6 looks like. I got a little bit more time. And this video isn't too long yet. Ah, this level sucks right out of the gate. Alright. I forgot that you can just cross over the sides like that. Okay. Oh, I made it. Uh, we are gonna want to be on this side. <laughs> yep. That's how it goes sometimes. What can I say? I just want to be on this side. Ah, that was not what I wanted to do. All right. I'm not entirely certain what the best way to progress here is. 
It might actually be to let this guy fill in a bunch of the spots. Also, to stop botching the jumps, I guess. That goddamn bird. Ah! Okay, I wasn't expecting it to spawn me exactly back in place. I can't believe it spawning me right back in place got me killed thrice. That is just embarrassing. Yes, I said thrice. What of it? No. Yeah, I, I like this game, honestly. I won't say it's not... I won't say it's not clunky and weird, but I do like it. Would, wouldn't say it's my favorite or anything of the early NES releases. That goes to Bloon Hunt. Not Bloon Hunt, Bloon Fight. Can't believe I said Bloon Hunt. What's wrong with me? Alright, we made it. Made it up here, okay. You get lost. That level seemed a lot easier. Ah. Zon in. Ah, this level is gonna suck. Okay. Especially with that bird right there. That is a terrible place for it. These platforms are not at all at sync. Oh my god. Oh, this is awful. Th this level is the worst one I've played by a large margin. I might just die. <laughs> yeah, that level sucks. But overall, I like how the game plays. I'm not very good at it. I don't think anybody really is. There, there are. There almost certainly are people who are. But it's a little sad this game was just completely forgotten. Well, I'm nowhere close to the top. Oh, that was my score from the first game. Never mind. Anyways, have a good one, guys. Later. I just gestured at a camera that's not even on. Wow. I've been doing this job too long. Anyways, bye.